In this video, we're going to get an introduction to what computer programming is all about. We're going to keep it fun, though, by learning how to program some simple computer graphics. Programs are simply a series of statements that tell the computer what to do. It's much like the steps in a recipe telling you what to do in order to accomplish some goal, like making a cake. What we're going to do now is look at a little program written in Robot Basic so you can see what a program really is. When you first start Robot Basic, you see the screen that's shown. If you accept the user agreement, you get a much bigger screen to do editing. Let me pull that into this small window. We're only seeing a little portion of the screen so that it's enlarged enough that you can read it here. You'll notice there's an area here that allows you to type in your program. If you just start typing or hit the backspace, that will erase. When you press this green arrow, this green triangle here at the top of the screen, that will run any program that you've typed in. Let's go ahead and type, press that. It'll run this blank program and open the screen, and I'll move it for us into the area. This is our terminal screen or output screen. There is a X in the far right hand corner that will be off the screen. So when I close it, we go back to our entry screen where we can edit our programs. The terminal screen actually has an output of 800 by 600. We're only looking at a small portion of that, about 600 wide. So in this area that we see here, where when we start to get an output, realize that we've only got maybe 600 by uh, 400, 450 or so that will be actually available to us. Let's write a program that will draw a line from the upper left-hand corner, which is 0, 0, that is x and y, x being the horizontal, y being the vertical. So we'll start from this corner and draw it down to some area, let's say down in this area, which would be maybe 500 across. Remember, we've only got 640 across total. And, and then maybe 300 down. So let's write the program that says, I want to draw a line. Notice I've capitalized the word line. That's not necessary, but it makes it a little more readable. A line from position 0, 0 to position 600, 300. If we press the Run button now, the terminal screen will come up and we'll see that line. <laughs> if we'd like it to be a little shorter, let's say around here, we can close this screen and go back and say I want, want it to maybe be 500 across. Let's take a look at that. Notice it shortened up a little. If we go to the beginning of that line and press enter and open up a space above, we can do things like I want to change the line width. And make the line width 10, for example. If I run the same program again, notice how much wider the line is. We can all do, also do things like set color. There are some predefined colors. Let's try red. If we run the program again, notice the red line. If we want to continue this line, we could put in I want to do a line 2. That continues it from the last point, so we only have to specify one xy coordinate. In this case, let's draw that line to the left, directly to the left. So maybe we'll go back to 300, which is only 300 spaces across instead of 500. And we'll keep it at the same vertical position, so we'll keep that also at 300. Had an extra comma in there. A 
if we run it again, notice it comes over and then goes back. If we want it to go further here, let's try that. If we want it to go further, instead of going back to 300, we could go back to 200. Notice the difference. This is a good point to pause in our lesson and give you a chance to see if you really understand what's going on. I want you to finish this program and draw one more line to make this a complete triangle. Here is the program so far. Just type these lines into your computer and then add one more statement that will draw that final line to make a complete triangle. Just pause this video so that you can read these lines without having to hurry.